Welcome to Tech Brothers with Damir. In this video, we are going to learn how to use Excel as data source in SSRS report. So let me show you the file I'm going to use here in this demo called source file and this is .xlsx. Uh, let's take a look. We have ID, sale person, first name, last name and other columns in this Excel file and this is on sheet 1. Now close this file. First of all, we have to create the ODBC DNS entry. So I'm going to go ahead and search and type ODBC. Once I search it, it will open ODBC data sources. So I'm going to go ahead and create the 32 bit. You can go to the control panel and start from there. And uh, I just searched it and that, that's why what I want to do ODBC data source administrator. So click on the system DSN. So it is going to be a data source name. That's what we are creating here. So let's go ahead and add and then try to find the driver here. So I'm going to go ahead and find the driver for our Excel. So Microsoft Excel driver and here we can see the extension. So one of them dot Excel as Excel. So we can read all these different type of files. Hit finish. And now here let's provide the name. So I'm going to call this one DS Excel. Description if you would like Excel 12.0 is fine. And select the worksheet. In my case it is on C users. Amir and then I have a videos folder so I'm gonna click here and now I can select source file dot Excel SX so hit OK we are good here and then hit OK now finally we can see the entry right here and uh, in this system uh, data sources now you hit uh, OK this is done part now we come back to the SSDT SQL Server data tools and create a new report so click here on the reports tab add new item and click on report let's call this one excel excel source report hit add report is created now we go to the data sources add data source and here we can call this one ds excel and now instead of the type here we need to select the ODBC. We are not using SQL Server anymore. We have ODBC. So click here and then go to edit. And here, let's see what we got here. Now click on the drop down and we will see DS Excel here. Select that part. Use a connection string. DSN is equal to DS Excel. That's the name of uh, our uh, DSN. And uh, we are good here. Let's uh, test the connection. Looking good. Hit OK. Now, next part is the we will be creating a data set right right click add data set and here I'm going to use uh, the data set embedded in my uh, report DS Excel and let's write our query so we'll say select asterisk from and then here we have to use parenthesis sheet one dollar sign so that's how you will write your query if you have sheet two or any other name you will be using here and you have to add dollar sign to the end and uh, that's it hit ok we can see all the fields here right click insert and table now let's bring some of the fields uh, so we can see our report and uh, let me get the city and uh, country that's all I need I'm gonna drag this one on the left make some space here make it report a little bit better and uh, let's make it bold and give this a color now let's see the report and as you can see that uh, this data is coming from uh, Excel. So you will be creating ODBC uh, DSN entry and uh, from there uh, you will be able to use uh, the, uh, that uh, entry DSN in your data source uh, in the SSRS report and pull the data from uh, there.